invite several staff members to her cookie party. Hey, now who's people not are, on the list? I love when people are angry because, you know, Lisa's always one who's angry. The news right, department right. was invited to something. So there are people who just are so furious with Lisa. Good. <laughs> you don't care? Everyone's invited but Will. Why? Why Will? Because he hates the party. He has said really mean things about it on air. I didn't get an invite. Everyone Will? loves Will. Will, Will can't do no wrong. Will didn't get invited. Jason didn't get invited. And Steve, the intern, didn't get invited. Wow. I, didn't I invited get an, Jason. I didn't get invited either. Hey guys. I don't know your email. He doesn't have one. I don't have an email, sweetie. What happened? Hello? I wasn't invited either. I was a little surprised. Why not Gary? Gary's Why? not going to come. Right, you don't Gary? Know that. And by the way, invitations shouldn't be sent out based on whether you're coming or not. It's a gesture. And sometimes you like to be invited whether you come or not. <laughs> None of the Howard TV people were invited. Oh, Just really? because this is Lisa who complains she when the news department. She always has a problem with the guest list, yes. And, and JD wasn't invited either. Oh. Why not? He's not cool enough for the party. Because no. Bruce Springsteen's not going to be there. Yeah, right. Yeah, well, how come JD's <laughs> not invited? Well, honestly, my internet went down the other night when I was going to send out all the invitations. Oh, what so kind of bullshit is that? No, my cable, my internet, and my phone. And you see me every day. I, you know I don't get email. I don't deal with that shit. You just got to see me. You see, say, hey, you right, want to come I'll... to the party. Why were the Howard TV people not invited? They hate the party. They. When have they said a good thing about my party? Right. For two years now. <laughs> well, why don't all you... those TV do you, have any, do you have any hot friends who go to that party? Yes. Really? Mm -hmm. Are they younger? <laughs> what? Oh, what was that, Artie? <laughs> then your weight? Yes, younger, they are. <laughs> younger than me, I bet. <laughs> You're not I, coming anyway. No, I would, why don't you drop two? Uh, let me give you a little bit. What if, you have, so what, if, what if Lisa's got some hot friends there? I know. But drop the cupcake theme. Just say you're having it's a party. It is. It's a holiday party. You don't have to bring cookies. Okay, if you want right. to, some people like to. Oh, all right. yeah, there's it's all kinds nice of weird stuff going on, like... See, I don't have time to get into it now because right. Beetlejuice is waiting and Duran Duran is going to get here. Oh, do we have a little time? Duran Duran's not until 8.30. Oh, is it, is it, oh, because it's, oh, 8.30, good, okay. Well, I get so into it now. So what's going on? So, so a lot of people have gotten gifts for Artie for his birthday. I threw a birthday party for him. Right. And Artie hasn't acknowledged them for getting the <laughs> gifts. <laughs> yes, this becomes a recurrent theme. And I know there are several people at the station who are just livid with Artie because, like, for example, Tracy, who <laughs> works here, has, like, she got Artie. Do you even know what Artie, Artie do you know what Tracy got you? Yeah, she got me a Yankee shirt, and I thanked her for it. And what, you, you walk around. I thanked and, her for it. No, she, according to her, you walk around. Oh, and Tracy, you, get in Lisa, here, you, you know about stupid this? Jerk. It happened to me twice. Well, go I ahead. I said, Artie, did you like what we got you? And D he does said, he even know what you got? No, him? he didn't know. Do you know? No, what I, I know. You got me right, those thermal told, shirts. Right, you got I told me those you three thermal times. shirts. And, and I said to him, I said, what, what, what was you your spend? end? Three dollars. Yeah. Oh, that was your thank you. I said, what you spend? What was your cut? About four dollars. I said, no, three. If the news department. First of all, if Tracy's mad at me, she's bullshitting. She's not mad at me. First I of know all, they Tracy. didn't even have your size. Hey, uh, <laughs> Jay, go in the back of the yeah. store. Artie, swear to God, I saw it firsthand yesterday because Jason was, um, Jason was going around, you know, putting this list together, and um, you, she gave you something for Christmas last year, which you've never acknowledged, and that she was irritated by that as well. I don't open all my. I have unopened Christmas gifts in my apartment from last year. I, I don't open them. I open them. You wore her gift in front of her that she gave. No, Christmas, no, no. Christmas. No, I didn't. Yeah, I, the rap on you is you wear people's gifts and you don't even walk up to them and say, "Hey, thanks for getting this." I walk. Me. No, no, that's not a rap on me. And the other rap is that Teddy, after the birthday party, put all your gifts in a plastic bag and then lost all the cards and like jumbled them up, oh, and you so don't know. He, he missed. So Artie doesn't even know who gave him what. Here, I'm going to test you. That's Teddy's fault. All right, Artie, someone gave you an autographed Jorge Posada picture. Who gave that to you? Autographed Jorge Posada picture? Yeah. Uh, Ronnie Mund. Okay. You got a DVD, Who's Documentary and ACDC Concert. Who gave you that? Who Documentary? The Who Documentary. And ACDC Concert. I have no idea. See, somebody got you an ACDC Concert DVD and a Who Documentary. Man, I had both of those things. <laughs> Howard, you of all people who treat people like shit after Bullshit. they give you a gift? Are you kidding me? I, them. Are you kidding? You know what I do? I have a special book. I open Dude, it. you didn't even touch it. You haven't. You, 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 my $1,200 Neil Young gift it. that you No, I told you. I knew you face. gave it to me. 
people. No, no bullshit. You're you're the worst with gifts. Did Howard. I write you a note? Howard, this Did is I write you a bullshit time where you're no. trying to fuck with me. No. You are the rudest gift receiver you're of wrong. all fucking time. I have a book. No, on the air we fuck sit. You. We have fun. Twelve hundred dollar fucking picture into the storage bin. On the air. And you love rubbing in my face. We on the Don't air. Fuck yourself. Well, then let me respond to that. On the air we kid each other, but the fact of the matter oh, is. Oh, then this is on the air. I wait created a, a new bit, guys. No, you didn't. Fuck wait a you. second. Here's what I do. Fuck you. Here's what I do, Artie. I you don't even touch a gift. Bullshit. I have a book. I write down everyone who gave Somebody me something. Somebody else should do this bit because you're not allowed to. You're the worst S gift receiver of all bullshit. fucking time. You see, you're going to keep interrupting me because that's your shtick. No, but that's not my stick. It's your stick. I make you're sure a rude every prick with gifts. No. Liar. <laughs> you're the rude prick. Oh the I have a, a book. With everybody's I know name. who got me nothing for Christmas. It's you, like everybody else here. <laughs> I got you. I, I, just, year, spent, I just spent about 20 grand on your party. Fuck you. Uh, I knew the 20 grand would come out. Yeah. Oh, I, I, no, we found out. I can tell you a couple of things. First of all, Steve Langford said He's just trying to get to me. Hold on. Here, here, wait, watch <laughs> this. Hold on, Howard, Howard, watch this. I'm not giving up. I want to defend you, though. Yeah. Steve Langford said that he Gary's going to defend you, Howard. Year. Surprise. Yeah, I'm a brown nose. <laughs> um... Last year, Steve Langford said for Christmas he gave everybody a very expensive bottle of champagne. Right. The only person that sent him a thank you note was you. Right. And by the way, Artie, here's the thank you note that so Howard your ha has sent me for something that I've given to him. Well, wow, wow Gar. Yeah, what is it? Show him that. Did you find that in Howard's ass? And that's. And by the way, the card <laughs> is because of Lisa G. She turned me on to that that card. All right, go ahead. All right, so anyway, so it shows uh, you I am a good gift receiver. There right. was a deflection here. <laughs> there was a deflection here. Yeah. It became about them instead of about the Okay, right, good. You right. want to read the list, guys? Yeah, slide it. Okay. I thank Ronnie for the Jorge Posada picture, buddy. All right, you got a beginner's guitar book. Who gave you that? Uh, Steve Brandonino. Right, you're right. <laughs> Brandino. <laughs> I don't know his name. Uh, <laughs> whatever. I fuck with Nobody his name. Nobody knows his name. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, forget. It. I'm not gonna go through. It. Who else? Because right, right, now you're you, now I'm I'm. No, I'm, who gave you? Who gave you a? Uh, <laughs> oh, you want to go through it? Yeah, well, I'm I mean, I got two out of you three. Know what, guys, who, who, who I gave you the bottle? Everybody of Jacks, go ahead, take your medicine. Who gave you the bottle of Italian red wine and book on history of New Jersey? Book on the history of New yeah, Jersey. Who gave that to you? Italian Have red you wine and the history of New Jersey. <laughs> yeah, who gave that to you? <laughs> See, you don't know. He doesn't know. Well, let's quiz you on some shit around here. Quiz let's me. Ask I just told you. You don't know people's names around Neither here. Neither do you. I know you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Isaac gave you that. And I know Isaac's name. Uh, I've slept through his wedding. <laughs> uh, keep going. Yeah, I bet All I know right. more than you know. Who you gave think? you two Gap shirts? This you should know. That these people. Right, the, right. News, the news the news department. department. Okay. Right. I I remember that was on right. here. Who gave you four frame photos of Artie with celebrities? Oh, so, Jason Kaplan. All right, good. And all I right. thanked him for that. And if none of these guys are Jason. running by, I thank you know Jason. What, do you know what Scott the Engineer gave you? Scott the Engineer gave me, uh, yeah, he gave me a DVD set. He gave me the... Um, Wrong. He gave you nothing. No, I thought I thought Scott gave me the seventy six. Well, he got to thank your note. Yeah, he got the only guy who got to thank was the guy who gave you nothing. All right, you don't know what the hell you're talking. Uh, listen, I, I, I listen. I am a heroin addict, guys. <laughs> that's no excuse. <laughs> oh, that's a good excuse. Well, well, listen. That's the thing. Nobody's upset. It's more bullshit that uh, runs through the bullshit factory that is this show. Uh, as I said on the air, I remember a lot of the people who got me a gift. In the quiz, I, I started naming them, like, practically every two out of every three I knew, so they had to abandon that bit. And uh, I come out here, and I'm like, are you mad? Are you mad? No, nobody's mad. No mad. It's a bullshit factory. Who's there, Ronnie? Beetlejuice. Is he in a mood? No, he's in a good mood, actually, right at the moment. He's all dressed up in a sports jacket and everything. Sports jacket? Yeah, like, I thought he'd be coming in, like, in a Halloween costume, but... What's uh, the special occasion? Today is Halloween. Oh, uh, so he's in a costume. No, he's not. He's in a... Oh, he's just dressed up. He's dressed up. He's huh. not in a costume. Let's see about wearing, this. Wearing a nice sports jacket and everything, <clears throat> you know? Oh, yeah. oh, look, 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 Let's go it is. Who gives a shit? Excuse me? Tell him that old fucking shit. He better hold the door for you. Fuck that old bastard. Fuck Ronnie, right? Ronnie need to go to the old folks' home and shit. Say, don't talk to Levy like that. Put his ass in the old folks' home and leave his ass there. He's too old for this job. 
You're just too old for shit. You're too old to be walking. You're too old to be fucking talking, you asshole. You say? You want to piss him off? <laughs> Beetle, fuck you up. Tell him what you're here. You're t- he's, he's done, this motherfucker. All right, let's get Beetlejuice in here. Beetle is here to announce, <laughs> that, announce that he hates Ronnie, the limo driver, and wants to be head of my security. Oh, really? Yeah. He knows he's the best. There he is, my friend. Uh, Beetlejuice. I lost my notes already. I have some Beetle notes. He looks like a superstar. You look like a superstar. You look great today, Beetle. Yeah. (laughs) Well. Hey, Beat. Hey, what's up? You look great, man. This is a whole new you. This is Beat the Business Man. Yeah. Yeah, What what is the suit and the nice shirt? Where'd you get these clothes? Where did you get them? Oh, I bought them. I bought them. You bought them. Yeah. And uh, you are here to announce... That you would like to be the head of security here at Sirius? Uh, could be, yeah. Yeah, why? You don't think Ronnie the limo driver knows what he's doing? Ronnie's a piece of garbage. What happened between you? You've been having, you've been having fights with some people here, especially Ronnie. What happened with you and Ronnie? Uh, Ronnie is just like a piece of shit. You don't need him. Wow. Well, why do you say that? I mean, when you say he's a piece of shit, I mean, uh, you know, it's funny. You're not the only one goofing on Ronnie. <laughs> do you know that Richard, who works here, for Halloween, <laughs> has a Ronnie, a Ronnie the Limo Driver costume. They say it's really? hysterical. What they is say that? It's hyster- I'm going to put my sunglasses on too, B, just like you. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to look like you. Hold on. I'm going to put sunglasses on. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We'll both be Take cool. Take your time. And uh, oh, here's Ronnie the Limo Driver. Is that Richard? That is good. <laughs> Ronnie, what happened between you and B? What, when did this first, when did this whole thing start happening? All right, here's what happened. All right. All right. First of all, nothing happened between me and Beetlejuice. Right. It's Levy. Oh. Hey, Levy's cooking up Levy's something? got no material for Oh, me. I ain't got nothing to do with that. So he brought Beetlejuice in as me. Yeah. And he should have dressed him up as a paycheck because that's his paycheck <laughs> there now. Uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> He, not, he shouldn't dress him up as me. Right. Because that's the only way he makes money now is with Beetlejuice. So, so B, you really do like Ronnie. Bob Levy. Wow. Bob put you up to this? Oh, I, I, didn't, I didn't do it. He, he, I, didn't, I just came in. There you go. That's all I did. See? I see. <laughs> so well, I, was, he, I, you, I was ready. Well, you know, that's you I handed, Bob Levy. So I handed I don't everything know over to that. him. Why does Bob Levy dislike you so much, Ronnie? <laughs> I, well, why would he Bob want, I think it's here. ever since that day I, 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 you know, I made him look like a piece of shit on the show. How's that? You know, like, like he's a shit comedian, and uh, he started throwing bottles at me and all that. And remember that day? He was sitting there with Artie back there behind the wall. And, so, uh, so, B, what I is I think it? he got very upset with that. I don't know. I don't now he's a new Bob Levy on his new pills now, and he's laughing out I, there. He's having a good time. So today's Beetle, my turn. Do you yeah. like Ronnie? Well... A little bit. Yeah. Oh, so you don't have a beef with so him. So what happens, nah. B? So Bob Levy got a hold of you, and he said, hey, well, dress up like Ronnie. Right. And then come in here and give Ronnie some shit. And they've been busting well, my balls all day. Well, he's been busting my balls. I don't have nothing to do with that. Yeah. Levy's here if you if you want to go down that road. Where is Richard's uh, <laughs> Ronnie costume? I want that for Howard TV. I want to see it. I, he needs another minute. Have you seen it, Ronnie? No, I have no clue. He, he evidently dressed up as you for Halloween. Wow. Yes. And they say it's unbelievable. I'm very excited about that. <laughs> and he walks around on his knees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah, definitely. I think he yeah. does. Well, let's get Bob Levy in here, and let's find out why he has a beef with Ronnie. So you don't want to be the head of security. Oh, I ain't got no, nothing to do with that. I tried to hand everything over to him. I, was I don't go know nothing. I, was going out to, I got, 20, I I got 22 people coming in here don't with Don't try to get me in, Andrew. He can I don't have nothing to do with that. Though. I'll go to breakfast with Tim. <laughs> oh, that's, Wait, all, comes, that's all you and him. Here, here comes Ronnie, the limo driver. That's between you and him. Wow. There's Ronnie. <laughs> Who's that? Sal or Richard? I ain't got nothing to do with that. That's Richard. I could tell by the red ears. You got a problem with me? Problem with you? Oh, you got that mask on. Who are you fooling, dude? I'm Ronnie. Who are yeah. you? Scars Man. You're Ronnie, yeah, huh? Yeah. Scars Man got a tattoo. Yeah, it's really bad. Yeah. yeah sc- Who are you fooling? Uh, What's your fucking problem, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Ain't no problem like like him with that mask on. <laughs> Who are you fooling, pal? I'm fooling you. Ha, <laughs> you couldn't fool nobody. I'm scores man. Who the yeah. fuck are you? Who the fuck is you, you jackass? <laughs> Behind that fucking mask. I'm <laughs> Ronnie. I know your name, Ronnie. You got that fake ass scatter. You're taller than me, but I'll still kick your yeah, ass. Yeah, still kick whose ass? Yourself? Yeah. 
Oh, that's too damn material. <laughs> Good new material. Look at the nice what, hair. What a nice jacket. Yeah, nice hair. <laughs> Wow, that's some. That's it's some, amazing. Uh, you'll see this on Howard TV. Richard is dressed up as Ronnie, the limo driver, scores man, and uh, it is quite the For, <laughs> former scores man. Yeah, it is a great outfit. Look at that. I'm headquarters man. <laughs> headquarters <laughs> man. Uh, what about uh, what about uh, Ronnie, the limo driver? Bob Levy is here. What? Why did you uh, ask Beetle to come in here and have sort of a fake argument with Ronnie? What? I think it would be. He always says he wants to be security. He's hey, training boxes now. You. I, I and you need well, someone yeah. to protect you. And how is this fucking guy going to protect you? Look at him. Yeah. Beetle is a man well, look that at you. fight. Uh, look, look at you. Oh, look I, at the mess you are. I can knock you out in a second, you old piece oh, of yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you kidding me? You Put us in the ring. Out. He will cry. He's I will not, knock that whole suit off of you. Out. He's knocking Go everybody out. out. Yeah, I, He's always Beetle. knocking people Beetle. out. would we fuck him up or what? I don't know. I got the ring for you. He got the ring. Let's do it. He's got the ring? I got the ring. You want me to bring the ring? out of Bring the ring in. Ronnie, do you think you could beat up Bob Levy? I don't know. I don't. That means I got the biggest I, I, No, you, you can't. Why would I say I'm it? saying yes. You're saying no. I bring my two hundred people. Beetle, wait a second. Beetle, you know these things. Yeah. Who would win in a fight, Bob Levy or Ronnie? I don't know. You don't know. You can't pick a winner. Who would you put your money on? Oh, I would put my I put my money on this one though. Exactly. Uh, Bob, right? I'll put it on Bob. Yeah. Really? Really? I'll fuck him up, and you know it, Pete. Wow. Pete, can you beat up Bob? No. You can't. You can't beat up Bob. <laughs> no. <laughs> Bob's a badass. Wow. See? Bob's a badass. Ronnie, you're not going to fight Bob Levy, are you? No, Me? man. I'm, nah. scared, I'm scared of him. You are scared. Yeah, I'm you. shitting my pants. Yeah, that's because you're I'm old. That's why pants. you're shitting your yeah. pants, you old fuck. Wow. I'm shitting my pants. <laughs> He would in a boxing match, it would be over. I would say within 30 seconds, he'd be on the floor. <laughs> There's no doubt about it. Okay, whatever you say, Tom. You say whatever, whatever, whatever you say. Whatever that you means say. I can't win. Just say, <laughs> just say you whatever can't win. You can't, you, say, you can't win. You guys drink who, all guys weekend. Guys with big mouths who run around, run oh, around. Oh, with big mouths. He's the most big mouth. could beat people oh. up. When did I? When did you ever hear me say I could beat somebody up? When did you? Ever oh, that's hear good. Tell Howard that. I'm sure he feels happy about hearing this fucking news. You don't run around bragging to people how you can beat people up. Me and Beat do all the time. Yeah. Beat'll knock well, you the fuck you, out. Hey, yeah, well, Beat'll got to do it. Beat'll ain't got nothing to do with this Who shit. Who did you ever beat up? <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Beat'll beat beat nobody else. Uh, who the fuck are you beating up? Uh, I'm saying... You, I want to know who you beat up recently. You're beating everybody up. You're saying you can take... Who, who did you beat up uh, recently? I haven't beat up anyone recently. That's why I want to beat you up. Well, yeah, well... I, I say in a boxing match, action. I can definitely knock out you just Ronnie. Can't, you can't handle it when I fucking get on your case. Uh, how well, how can I handle it? can't handle it. I can't handle I'm the one Dude, that can handle it. Look at you. You're shaking like you got arthritis, Dude, you, you old sat, fuck. Look sat, at you. You sat back there. Right you throwing track. bottles at people. I threw a bottle at you. That was yeah. one fucking day. Yeah, that was one why? fucking day because you, you pissed me it. off that day. But now I'm on pills and I'm now not you drinking. Could, you could, now you I can knock it. you on your old fucking you ass. Bob, you're saying Ronnie threw a bottle at you? No, I did Remember that day that the show went to like 1230 because he came in like a fucking big shot at the end of the show talking shit? I'm God, motherfucker, and you know it. You're security. There's sucks. your comedy right there. There's your comedy. You brought him with you today. I take him on the road. There's we help paycheck, each other right out. Right on the couch. Yeah, his paycheck is bigger than yours, I bet, you little oh, oh, shit. Would you like to compare? All right, Beat, would how you much like you make compare? a year? Tell him. <laughs> I make more than that, pal. Exactly. <laughs> I make more than that, too. Exactly. Don't take no shit from him, Beat. Hey, you know, he, he doesn't wait. He, makes, he drives a car around. He's a fucking cab driver. That's yeah, what he okay. is. Oh, let's cab driver. Me, let's me and if you he was a fucking paychecks. cab driver, he wouldn't have no let's fucking money. Exactly, hey, exactly <laughs> Beetle. He'd be riding you. a fucking okay. train. Okay. Yeah. Let me, I'll drive around with you one no, day no, and no. see how good you bring are at your job. And then you come to a comedy show and we'll see how good your, I am, you little your, fuck. Bring in your 1099 for the end of the year. I want to see it. Okay. We'll compare. It'll be a big piece of paper in your fucking hands. Yeah, well, bring it in. Bring it in, big Bob, after the show, I'll tell you what a 1099 is. Okay, thank you. This fucking guy didn't even know where 10 sets are. Hey, let me ask you, Beetle, Beetle, I don't want to get up. Guys, hold on for one second. Okay. Stay here. You uh, trained Mike Tyson and you trained um, other professional boxers, several professional boxers. Talk a little bit about that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What, what, at what years were you training Mike Tyson? Oh, a lot of years. Yeah. A lot of years. Uh, how were did they you... the good years or the bad uh, years? No, a lot of years, but it's way back in the 50s. In the 50s? Yeah. yeah. Okay. And why, why did you feel that Mike Tyson, why why did he become such a great boxer for a while? What did he have well, that other Well, he was, but, you know, I took him off because... 
It's too many. It's too many fights, so yeah. I have to take them off for a week. So. He, yeah. he had too many fights. Too many fights. You get into her too many. Ah. Uh, Who's taking care of Beetle now? Is it uh, Sean's brother? I heard Sean's brother's up here. Oh, yeah, 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 he's here. Yeah, I, feel, sure. I feel so bad for this poor guy. Why? Poor like, guy. This poor guy has a, a great life. He's a well-dressed guy in a business suit, hey, a clean cut. Hey, the man and he's is hanging out hey. with this. Hey, guy. the man's want to hang out. I, I don't, he hangs I don't out. get it. What's the matter get it. with you? You don't the guy, get the guy hey, looks like he's confused. Listen to me, pal. You don't get enough pussy in the weekend. He's confused. Do you? He doesn't what? even know why he's here. I don't think. Hey, gets don't no you understand? You don't get no pussy in the weekend. This guy gets pussy, right? You don't get. You yell. You Let's fuck some more. He fucks them. If you can have the pussy, okay. I don't think you could. Whatever you say, pal. How you're much? in charge oh, now. Whatever I said. I told you, you're in charge. You're out there now. How much pussy do you get? Shit, I get more pussy than we can do in the fucking week. Really. He's the yeah. man. He's the man. He's taking over. He's driving you home today, too. <laughs> yeah, he's probably you driving him home. Today. Driving, I dri get in the car and Beetle just is driving you home. <laughs> he's driving you home. That'd Beetle, be cool. take the key. Maybe I wouldn't drive you home. No, what I is don't. this fucking guy is crazy or what? So why do you why do you feel bad for Sean's brother? But look what he's what involved with here. <laughs> Look, he's involved look with this. Look what you're involved look with. Uh, look, you're I'm in the hallway. With the, I'm in the involved hallway with the greatest with... radio show hey, ever. Hey, the man not... had his own problem. Look at the guest the here. So you're a guest. I'm happy to be you're a guest. guest. You're here. miserable to I'm be on the show, you cranky fucking billy goat. I'm here for 22 <laughs> years. I don't know what you're here for 22 years. Where have you been? Where I've been working, man. You've been sitting in the hallway for 22 years. I don't understand something. You take care of Beetlejuice on the road. Yes, I do take care. And Sean's brother now takes care of Beat. Business now because Sean had the stroke, so he's taking right. care of the business, the private part. Uh, party markets I see. and that. And, and and I understand Sean's oh, well, brother's he married, has. he has kids. Yes. And the kids know Beetlejuice? Oh, they love him. He's great with kids. <laughs> Beetle, he came to my oh, house one definitely. day, he was playing catch with my kids, swimming and all oh, that. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, Bob, you must be a great influence on the kids. I am. Yeah. And Florence, They're about the size talking. of you, you prick. Bob, can what I ask you a question? Have to do, what does that have to do with it? What was that? Yeah. I want to ask you a question. When Beetle's with you, does he ever have accidents? What the hell is you talking about, uh, man? Now Gary's uh, giving no. you shit. Hey, Gary, look who's talking in the office. Look at you. Did you have an accident? Look at you. <laughs> look at that accident. face of yours. I was four, but I had one. Oh, you, oh, you didn't have an accident somebody after somebody crashed you in the face? I don't understand, B. What's he talking about? What's what kind of accident? What, what kind of accident are you talking about, yourself? Like a shit accident. Like you accidentally... Oh, you shit on yourself, somebody do some shit on you? It's happened. Has it ever happened to you? Oh, it never happened to me. It probably happened to you. Never shoot yourself. Never. Hey. Hey. So like a little girl or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you go home and play with the midgets? Hey, uh, hey, uh, hey, B. I saw something on Howard TV where you got into a fight with Sal. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was going to knock Sal ass out. I saw, cause I, I'll play the clip for you. This is Beetlejuice yelling at Sal at a gig. Oh, yeah. Um, I was going to kill him. Put up the sound. This motherfucker, man. He did something a motherfucking pussy. I ain't no fucking pussy. Talking all that shit. Say things about me. Oh, I got dirty pep. I got dirty poppin' on me. I got dirty poppin' on me. I shit on myself. He told her every story. I had dirty poppin' on me. Oh, I got shit on myself. Yeah, I do, I, yeah, I gave you shitty dirty drawers. Yeah. Why, you talking shit on me? Cause I be starting on with you? Cause you can call me a dirty, call me, call me dirty name? I'm a fucking pussy? I ain't no motherfucking pussy. Get the fuck out of here. Wow. Where's the clip of him yelling at Sal? He got into a fight with Sal. Beat, you really almost took Sal's head off. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, are things better between you two now? Oh, definitely. I would have done it, yeah. Uh, are you, oh, definitely. All right. You're leaving, if you Ronnie? Need, if you need me, call me, okay? All right, thank you. <laughs> want me to open the door for you? I want to find out what happened between you and Sal. Where is Sal? I want to get that straight right now. I mean, what's he talking? Is he talking stuff about you? Talking a lot of shit, Sal. Let's straighten hey. it out right now. Sal, get in I here. Don't, I don't, don't want to get... Beetle's my friend. I don't want to say anything. Yeah. Sal, you Beetle's know, my friend. Hey, let me handle this, Beetle. Yeah. Beetle's my friend. What are you saying about him to get him so upset? Well, the thing is, how when we're on the road, I take care of Beat, and he shits his pants all the time. What? And he has a diaper, and I change the diaper, and I put him in the tub, and I wash him up. <laughs> the hell are you talking about? What are you about? talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about? Is that true? I love Beat. What the hell is you talking about? You wearing diapers? <laughs> Do I look like I'm wearing a diaper to you? If no. I saw you about... Do I look like a diaper guy 
out of you? Pete, when we were in the hotel and... and Do lost... I look like a dead topic to you? Yes, no. yes, of course. I don't. Pete, when we were in the hotel... I'm a grown man. I don't wear diapers. I know, but... I I've don't. changed your diapers. Well, in the... well I, One don't, time... I, don't, I don't wear fucking diapers, dude. One time we had to go to uh, Kmart hey, and we bought little boy's worry, pants I, I, I for him because wear, he shit his no... original pants. So we had to go to Kmart. So what? I wear original pants. So what? It's all they good by me. ain't got nothing to do with that. Yeah, but you know what? I'm looking well, after you. Well, I'm upset me, but hey, I can take care of myself. I ain't no little kid. Hey, if you could take care of yourself, hey, you wouldn't have shit all over your pants, all over your what legs. I does. Hey, beat. Why many hands? I'm the one cleaning the Don't shit up. Don't worry about what I does, dude. No, but right. when I'm with you and I can't breathe in the hotel room, Mom, I'm puking my brains out. Get the fuck you got... out there. <laughs> right. Hey, beat. Want me to handle this? Let me tell you something. If you ever say anything bad about beat again. You're going to have to fight me. Uh, I'm sorry, Howard. <laughs> I don't know what to do here. Cause... Right, Pete? I'll, t I'll fight him. You don't even have to. So Unless you, you want to fight him, I'll fight him. You so want me you to fight to him? Do, <laughs> I'll fight the motherfucker. Pete, I'm sorry, man. So I don't want. Do, man? I don't want Howard to kick my ass, Pete. But you know, I got to clean you up and stuff. And you know, sometimes you stink up the whole room. Me? And how can I stink up the room when I'm not even there? Oh, you're there, all right. If I'm dead, if I'm dead, I'm in my own room. I'm not Where's bothering nobody. Hey, I'll, I'll settle it. Where's Sean's brother? He'll tell Come on. us. He'll tell I'm not dead yeah. to fuck with nobody. Where is your manager's brother? Come on, now. You know I don't fuck around, and you know I don't do shit like why that. Why is he yeah. saying yeah. these things? Why, yeah. why is he saying that, Beetle? Why is you saying things to me like that? But, I don't do things to nobody. No, nah, but I love Beetle. I'm, I know I'm you cleaning you up. I don't do it. I don't do. I don't shit in my pants. Well, I never does. I mean, Sean's brother. I don't even know your name, but I know Sean real well. How, how you doing? My name's Bobby. Good. Hey, Bobby. Good to see you. Now you've been taking care of Beetle while your brother's recovering. Yeah, mm -hmm. helping out. Helping out a little bit. Mm -hmm. What? What is all? Have you ever seen Beetle go, um, make a duty? You know, it's interesting. He uh, the other day he did have some duty in his pants. Right, <laughs> a little, a little. That's okay. called a skid mark, right? Baby? Skid mark. I've had that. Beat. A little bit. We yeah. all yeah. had a duty. Well, man, it every turned... man gets it. Yeah. <laughs> all right, a little bit. I get you a little bit. It turns out it much. wasn't his though. Well, I'm what? sorry, what? It turned out it wasn't his duty. <laughs> no. No. Whose no. duty was, it was in his pants? Uh, <laughs> it was Bob Levy. No, no. no. <laughs> it was Bob Levy shit. <laughs> How did Bob Levy shake it in it, your opinion? It wasn't, no, it was actually Dominic. No, it was actually Dominic, Dominic shit. Oh. His friend Dominic the Dwarf. Yeah. Well, how did you When I woke up, I said, Beetlejuice, what happened here? He said, that fucking Dominic. No. <laughs> yeah, you, Dominic yeah. came in in the middle of the night and took a shit in Beetlejuice's pants. And then left. <laughs> Beat, is that true? Woke up, he was gone. Dominic shit in your pants? He shit in my pants and left. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Dominic the Dwarf no, shit in your pants. Wait, Wait, I wanted great. to kill that yeah. little bastard. <laughs> uh, Beetle, I'm sorry to hear that. That's a terrible yeah. thing. That's yeah, a terrible how could thing. he do that? Now, you say Beetle uh, lives with your family as well, right? Some days during the week? A couple days a week, yeah. yeah. How many kids do you have? I have three. Yeah, and how old are the kids? Ten, seven, and two. Now, are they a little freaked out by Beat or... Uh, uh, somewhat. Yeah, yeah they, a little bit. They stare at him. Where does Beetle <laughs> sleep? The two-year-old must have fun with him, right? Yeah. Yeah, and what about the ten-year-old? <laughs> the two-year-old scared to death. He is? <laughs> he takes one look, he goes the other way. He does. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what about the... <laughs> what, what? They go the other way, but I don't think that at all. The two-year-old is smart. What about the ten-year-old? What is, what is the ten-year-old can't take his eye off him. Right. Uh, <laughs> that's my oldest boy. My yeah. daughter just... She can't take an eye off him either. Yeah, no, right. Uh, they, they'd like to watch Beat, huh? Where yeah. does Beetle sleep? He sleep. He won't sleep in a bed. I have a spare bedroom, but he won't. He said he does better on couches. <laughs> <laughs> See, why is that? I don't why know do what he like I like sleeping on couches because it's better for me. Yeah. Why? Really? Like, huh? he, he, well, why? He just no, use... screw from my back because yeah. I see. Yeah. He's got a bad you know back. That? You have a back situation. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And the couch is better than a bed. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So the kids. You like the kids? Oh, the kids are fine. Yeah. Yeah. yeah they're a little freaked out. What do you out. do with the kids? Oh, I don't do Steals nothing. Their they diapers. Just, they just stares. <laughs> they you know. stare. Okay. Those kids yeah. don't shit in your pants, do they? Oh, no, I don't know nothing. Nothing about no. that. I hope. I don't know nothing. Yeah. Well, let me tell you, this sounds wild. I mean, it sounds like a reality now, show. No, Peter, you yeah. used to cook at at Sean's house. Do you cook? No, no, I cook at my uncle's house. Right? Yeah. He actually grills. He grilled at my house. Oh, did he? Yeah, most steaks of the time. and everything. Is he a good cook? Well, we didn't eat it. <laughs> <laughs> well, he ate it. <laughs> well, Beetle, it all sounds like a lot of fun. And how's your brother doing, Sean? Sean okay? Yeah, he's yeah. doing all right. He's all right? Good. Yeah. Tell, send him my love. I, I know he's uh, having a tough time, right? Definitely. Yeah. So your kids, when they hang out with Beat, the 10-year-old, like, like watches him. Now, are they the same height, the 10-year-old and Beetle? Uh, he's a little taller than Beetle. 
yeah. couple <laughs> inches taller. Yeah. And he, Running? Yeah, he's intrigued by the fact that he's bigger than a grown man. Uh-huh. He likes that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Let me tell you something, Howard. Beetle's a player. I yeah. Last show in Kentucky, I kid you not, a girl gave Beetle oral yep. in front of 20 guys. Oh, yeah. Right after the show. Oh, really? Sex. With her boyfriend right there. Right next in front of her. Are you serious? Yep. I Wait swear to you. Beetle, what you're claiming is, after the show backstage, you're hanging out, minding your own business. Mm -hmm. Right. A girl comes back there. Was she good looking? Yep. Yeah. She was a hot blonde. Yeah. yeah. All right. And she, she was with another hot girl, too. And she was right. with her boyfriend. Yeah, her boyfriend. And then she yeah. just said to you, Beetle, I'm a fan and I want to blow you? Wow. Oh, yeah, definitely. Are you serious? I'm yeah. not kidding. Oh, I was, swear to God, I was there, too. I'm not kidding. Had his dick right out. How big is it? <laughs> Tell him how big it is. I had my big balls hanging out. Yeah, yeah and... and <laughs> Buddy, you don't even get blown after this. Show. <laughs> no, not even. It's not that easy. <laughs> no, not like that. that I mean, you just got to ask I her. I, I, I swear to God. I swear to God. I swear to God, she did. You want to know? Here's a play by play. She went to beat her. She told him she loved him. Mm -hmm. She started making out with him. Whoa. And then yeah. somebody in the crowd dared her to put his penis in her mouth. She got to her knees and he stuck it and she put it in her mouth for about 25 seconds. Did you drop, <laughs> did you drop a load on her? I dropped a load right in the mouth. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and wow. he, he titty fucked her too. Yeah. Right, right after he did. Did you titty fuck her? Titty fucked her. I had my finger between her asshole and no fucking titty. Nice. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Every weekend he gets chicks that are all over him. Are you serious? I swear oh, to God. Serious. I'm not kidding, Howard. In front of the boyfriend and the boyfriend didn't get the angry? The boyfriend didn't do shit. The boyfriend was scared. Yeah. <laughs> he thought he was going to come in his mouth. There was oh, like no. thirty the people. Did Beetle, really, did Beetle have an orgasm? He uh, he got a wreck pretty quick, man. He did, but did yeah. he did he did he finish? N I, I don't know. Unless she swallowed, I didn't see anything. Yeah, oh, she swallowed it. Yeah. We backed <laughs> away pretty she quick. She swallowed like it's like fucking candy. Uh. <laughs> and Beat, after something like that happens. Do you feel on top of the world like you can get any Shit. girl you I want? I look like top of the fucking king. But when I you were in you high school, you didn't want to go out on tour anymore. I thought you were Me? tired of touring. <laughs> Nah, nah, can't spend another week to do that. Yeah, he, he found he found new. Uh, he's invigorated he's got now. Got renewed energy. Yeah. Yeah. So so. Uh, yeah, it's called Bob's mortgage. You know, it's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, for Beetle, something to you. Yeah. Beetle, the craziest <laughs> things happened to Beetle. I swear. First of all, the shit fairy visited Beat and, and yeah. left a shit in his pants. Uh, oh, that, know, that, that definitely that was that, no that, way. Dominic, Dominic, oh, Dominic, no. and then all of a sudden the girl's blowing you backstage. It's unbelievable. Yeah. And when this happened, do, do people? What do people do? Do they Does video? Tape yeah, it? everybody. There's cameras flashing. It's it's amazing, wow. and th this it happens every weekend. Some girl makes what'd the girl, out. What the girl look like? She was a blonde with short hair. She kind of looked like um, oh, who's don't, Richie don't Sambora's ex-wife? Don't say that. Ha hey, uh, Heather Lockyer. When the last time we had Bobby up, uh, what we were about him? She looked though. like Heather oh, Lockyer. But not about me. I got to tell you what this guy did. <laughs> what did he do? What did he do? gets on the stage, right? Yeah. He's drunk, right? Yeah. <laughs> so I had a blonde girl come on this, on top of the stage. Yeah. And she comes out. She has a fucking period. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she had a cold jacket and he had fucking blue cheese in the oh. hand. There was a string hanging out. <laughs> we seen a string hanging out and Beetle goes, there's a mouse problem in here. Oh. I said, no, there's a mouse trap. <laughs> <laughs> a mouse trap. <laughs> Oh my God! You know, I said awesome. I got you real good. That's why, he's, that, the, that's why he's, he's the headliner. I said, man. Bobby, you got it really good. You like that one? He, he is so the you man. saw a tampon string hanging out, and you said, "Hey, was there a mouse trap yeah. in there?" I said, "Yeah, there's a mouse trap Boy, for you there, That's mouse. a good joke. <laughs> Who wrote that? He I comes did. up with it. He's wow. he's gold. I mean, me, I came up with it. Yeah. Well, I tell you, what's going on backstage is unbelievable. I, I'm shocked. What goes shocked. on on stage? I didn't know that you. Why were is going on stage? I went in the back window. Oh wow! After the show. <laughs> Pete, do you think you'll see this girl again or probably not? Just oh, the one night I thing? don't know. I'll probably see her again. I right. think she woke up and killed herself. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think she woke up and killed herself because she probably jumped out the window before he came. <laughs> You know, Sal, you sound like you're so close to Beetle. I love him so and, much. And, and, and yet, uh, you and Beetle had that terrible fight. And, and uh, Beetle, are you feeling any better about Sal, or is, are you going to keep your distance? Well, that's on him, man. If he wants to say, hey, that's on him. You know, we made up. Remember, Beetle? We made up uh, at I, yeah. the night of the show. Try. We say that, you know, though. What? Did he take back what he said? Yeah, he took it back. Yeah. yeah. Well, what did was, you say? He was scared. What did I, what what I say, did you to say to start the fight? I, I said that, you know, Beetle, I'm just getting sick and tired of uh, changing your diapers that are loaded with shit and you're stinking up the hey, whole town and you're stinking up, up the town. Hey, I got to stick up the place and I wasn't... Hey, I got my own room. I got to stick up the place and not even, not even there, yo. That wasn't even his shit. Yeah, that wasn't Dominic. even my shit. What are you talking about? Dominic drove to Kentucky. <laughs> yeah. Well, Dominic <laughs> drove to Kentucky. He's the one shitting in his pants. Yeah. All right. How can you blame him for well, that? Well, we got to find this Dominic, Beetle. <laughs>
<laughs> well, that's up to you, so you find him. He's your boy, not mine. He ain't shitting in my pants. He's shitting in yours. Hey, he's shitting in yours, too, last week. <laughs> <laughs> to book a Beetlejuice for an appearance, you must go to his website, which mm-hmm. is chock full of Beetlejuice stuff. It's jollydwarf.com. It's a very, very popular site if you've never been on it. Jollydwarf.com. You're, you're actively involved in managing oh, that, right? That's right. right. Yeah. Definitely. All right. And uh, Bobby, uh, say hi to Sean for me, of course. And uh, uh, here is a clip of, uh, by the way, Beetlejuice for you Howard TV fans. Here is Beetlejuice yelling at Sal outside of a hotel. Here he, here he tells oh, Sal he's off. What are you going to do when Bobby You're talking he's about he's drunk. I'm not going to say he's a word. Drunk. You're talking about I'm not going to say Sal. a word. Come on, man. You're talking about bullshit. All right, I'm not going to say a word. Shit, I'm not going to say a word to Bob. You're talking out of You want to handle this with Bob You're talking out of bullshit about Bob. me, bitch. You want to handle this with Bob You're talking out of bullshit I'm about not, me, bitch. You are fucking wasted out no, of your no, no. mind right now. You're talking you're out of bullshit. You're supposed to do a show tonight. You're talking out of bullshit, All right, I'm talking dude. bullshit because you're drunk. You're talking and out Bob of bullshit. And Bob Levy's going to yell at no, you. No, you're talking out on everybody no, on the no, show. No, no, Fuck him. you talking out of bullshit too, dude. All right, go ahead. Wow. Every... Man, he was every weekend. Yeah, hey, <laughs> not hey, every I got weekend. the right to say what I gotta say. Dude. It's only when you piss him off that hey, he gets like that. When people piss me off, that's it, when you. That's when you get hurt. I gotta tell you, Beetle. He's I, telling Beetle. you that you're drunk. Are you hey, drunk? Beetle. When I'm drunk, I don't give a shit. Hey, Beetle. <laughs> I gotta tell you something. You know, I know you as a gentle guy, hey, and you know you're my hey, friend. Hey, when, when I, I get see ready, you like I'm that, ready to fight. Boy, when I see you like that, you're not scared of anybody. You are. Oh, nobody don't scare me. Wow. I don't scare to nobody. Nobody don't scare me. It's always mm-hmm. awkward to watch a fight. I can take it, man. I can take it, Beetle. Hey, Beetle. I can uh, take it, Beetle, but I, I don't... On the phone real for quick. For me, I'm, you, a, I'm a grown man. I can take any day. Beetle, your underwear is on the phone. Hi, Beetle's underwear. How are you? Howard, I gotta be honest with you. It's fucked. I had a shitty job. I mean, he's, <laughs> Dominic... He, he, Dominic, he's not involved. Beetle shits himself every day, and I'm getting sick of it. Yeah, uh, fuck he, you. He, Beetle, no, he had a sandwich this morning and it fucking stinks down Yeah, there. go he fuck yourself. He chicken wings last night. All right, thank you. All right. That's Irish John, you're on <laughs> the air. Rock li- yeah, piece of shit. That's your underwear call. Right? <laughs> he called okay. a piece of shit. <laughs> Irish John, you're on the air. Hey, Howard, I was at one of Levy's shows a couple of years back in Philly, and there were two guys backstage saying shit to his girlfriend. In a matter of seconds, he knocked the shit out of these two really? guys. Really? Threw him over a garbage can. You remember these guys, Bob? The guys dressed like... Oh, I did. Oh, I thought you were talking about him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Four of them, and the other two dragged the other guys out. Bob was like, now get the fuck out of here. Threw them out of the backstage area. Remind me of that... T- the- so you know how to handle yourself. I used to have a temper. Right, but now... Oh, I, I worked with Levy in Boca Raton about four years ago. This motherfucker came back in uh, maybe six years ago, that was. Yeah. It was good. And uh, I turned away for a second, and Levy had tackled the guy over all these chairs. <laughs> I looked over, I just saw Levy's ass and the guy's feet flailing. And... You like to fight. You no, like I don't like good. to fight. I didn't like to... They, they, were in, they were in, like, your face. The guy was in your face and yeah, KC's face. He was yelling face, at and, me and KC. And it was just bullshit. You know, I hate that, like, when it, you know, I don't like to see my friends get fucked around. That was not right, a great bro. gig where you did it both. Boca Nuts in Boca Raton. <laughs> the sixth well, show. Beetle, you're on a roll. Beetle, you're doing great. I'm proud of you. you, yeah. you That's know, the way to do it. Your career is blossoming. You look great today in a suit. Thank you. Have, uh, have you lost some more teeth, Beetle? Me? Yeah. Nah, that's been there. Really? That's been there. There's well, nothing in the front. It, it does look a little wider. Yeah. He's, yeah, going, is, yeah. he's going to the dentist soon to get them fixed, but he's been telling me. You are going. Oh, soon. yeah, it is. It is. You ought to get those shiny white teeth like a lot of the Hollywood yeah, guys. The yeah, the skin right. done, yeah. Just yeah. put two chiclets in there. <laughs> Why don't you stick my balls in your mouth? <laughs> nice! <laughs> oh, wait, that wasn't me, B. Hey, Beat, are you still a... Beat, I'm curious, are you still a fag? No, you still you stay a fucking gay bitch. Are you still a dick sucking faggot? You still faggot? my bitch? Do you still like? <laughs> do you still like the fuck guys? Oh, you like the fuck guys? No, like gay? last time, hey, all joking aside, you used to like fucking guys in oh, the ass because you you're a fat. Guys, huh? you, don't, you don't like doing that anymore. I don't fuck guys. Yeah, I heard you hey, fuck Artie. guys. What are you out of your fucking mind? Artie. What? This guy just got a blowjob backstage from a beautiful girl. Yeah. Uh, well, I don't know. I, I think that's bullshit. Oh, bullshit. it's not bullshit. bullshit. They got it on film. Bullshit. I got it on film. How you like But what it? about all the stuff on film of you getting fucked by guys? Hey, how like wow. you get fucked by an old fucking woman and you get fucked by? 
Exactly. <laughs> Beetle, I, I get I a whole lady to fuck. I think you. that's the first argument I've won with him. Beetle, <laughs> I got to tell you something. Yeah, you get you be the first one, and the whole ladies fuck you first. Beetle, you've never looked better. <laughs> you look like a million bucks. Yeah. I love this suit. I don't know where you got it. You should get ten more. Oh, you, I get a lot ter- more. You look terrific. You got in it in the Ronnie section of the store. <laughs> yeah, you look like an edge of Ronnie's balls. I got to tell you something, Beat. There's not too many guys who can do it all. You are a triple threat. And uh, you do a great job. You can shit, piss, and puke. Oh, shut up, I'll poop on you, you fuck. <laughs> right. And you can tell people off, and I admire that. You always stick up for your own rights. Uh, I am going to suggest to my audience, Beetle, that they rush to get tickets to see you because I know they go fast. Oh, yeah, they definitely go fast. And any hot chicks who are around who want to come down there and afterwards probably have oral sex with Beetle. Beetle, Beetle. Oh, definitely. Yeah, he loves it. Pete, how'd it go in the studio? Oh, it's, I did fine. I did pretty good. Yeah, you had a good time? I had a great time. Now, what's Sal's problem? Why was hey, you coming in? Hey, that's his problem, me. Hey, that's his problem. He did well, but not me. He keeps on saying that, that you wear diapers and stuff? Hey, no, he the one wearing diapers. I don't say shit. So he's lying? He's lying. Yeah. Is that why you guys got in a fight on that video we just watched? Oh, yeah. I was going to knock his ass out. Yeah, you were close? Hell, yeah. Does he do it a lot? Hey, he's the one who's getting drunk, not me. And then, what, what's Ronnie's problem? Hey, Ronnie? Yeah. He's a real asshole. Ronnie, see you later, you piece of shit! Jimmy Kimmel mentioned the death of Robert Goulet. Did he cry? No, not like, no, he didn't. <laughs> I guess he never met him once for two seconds. <laughs> he didn't cry like when John Ritter died. Right. And I'm surprised because clearly they did have a connection when right. he recorded yeah, the song. Yeah, you'd think he'd get a little drippy. The one time I cried on this show, I made the smart decision of not talking while I was crying. Yeah, I'm yeah. very pissed yeah, yeah, yeah. at you for that. <laughs> because we had a great crying scene and you didn't let us hear Is you. that when you admitted to your heroin use? Yes. Yeah, yes. yeah that was good. I asked you to be quiet and leave the guy alone. The fuck is wrong with you? Hmm. You all right, man? You want to take a break? I'll leave you just alone. Oh, no. Well, hey, man, I'll tell you what. I'm happy you're feeling better. It's a good day. All right. I'm happy you're feeling better. That's all. I'm supposed to do a commercial. Today is a good day. I will do a commercial. Yes. Let's let's break. No, no, I got to read a commercial. Oh, you got to read oh, a commercial. Shit. We were in a commercial? We, yeah, we were in the middle of a commercial. That we... was a commercial. Artie, right, you read a commercial. <laughs> All right. oh. See, I told you that bum thing was a bad idea. It was a downer. Oh. <laughs> it was a downer. Artie, I'll never bring bums oh. in again. All right. Anyway. The sound of spreads, teasers, and... Oh, I can't do a live commercial right now. No. Can you play, play a, song? a song? Yeah. All right. Uh, uh, yeah. All right. Thank you. <laughs> they only have the pictures on the TV. I had to go over and hug Artie after I, I knew. Mm. Well, Robin did too. Everybody no. hugged. But I, 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 uh, I knew enough to not speak. <laughs> yeah, he, he just. You didn't even bother. I saw the tears, though. Mm. Yeah, right. Yeah. No, they were there. I'll admit that. Yep. It happens. But, Howard uh, has never cried on the show. No. I wish we had a fucking Howard TV mic at the Phoebe Snow concert. Right. Yeah. I, I really, you know what? I didn't have tears, but I really felt welling up going uh. on. Uh, yeah, but I, I could have lost it. She, she was a woman in pain. Have you ever cried over something outside of family, like in public? Yeah, as any, like, no. as a play ever brought you to tears? Yeah, you or? said there was some movie you cried at. Yeah, it was. Maybe it was Barbarella when I saw Jane Fonda's tits. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm trying to think. There was a movie. Yeah, there, there's been. Uh, and, a, and a song. 
Yeah, I've had, I've yeah, I've had tears, but not not you know not like what happened to you at the Michael Jackson concert. <laughs> I took a date. I took a uh, well, not a date. A friend to see. Uh, Already cried at a Michael Jackson oh. concert. Uh, you know what I've cri- I've seen twice now. Should have cried because you were there. You know what I've seen I've seen twice now, and I cried both times. Uh, Jersey Boys. <laughs> you cry in Jersey Boys? Oh, when, his, when his daughter is kid. Come on, that's oh, rough. When my, his, the daughter becomes a heroin addict, she right? She dies, and then he goes into... Death know. is an easy cry. What was it, Man in the Mirror or Man something? in the Mirror? Is Listen, that the one you cried at? Okay, can I explain myself? <laughs> no. I went with or a bunch she's of, out of my life. I went with a bunch of people, <laughs> and... It was 1988. My old man was sitting at home, paralyzed, and there were all these guys in wheelchairs in front of us. We were right in front of the handicap section, and yeah. I looked at that, and it made me. What was what was he singing? Man, man in, the in the mirror. I thought so. Okay. <laughs> How awful. So Michael Jackson touched you. I think it was more of the wheelchair guys. Right. And then I told my buddy I had smoked a joint in the in the uh, bathroom. Right, and got in your eyes. There's an Elton John song that makes Gary cry. I know that. He yeah, thinks, we did that to him. He once. thinks about his brother, which is, uh, I played it on the air and Gary did cry. And it's kind of a lame, like, I know Elton John songs that are very emotional. And it's kind of a lame one. Yeah, right. Yeah, like, like don't let the sun go down on me. It's like emotional. But yeah. what's the one you cry at, Gary? What's that? What's that Elton John song you cry over? Uh, what are you gonna do this for? Mm. I'm, gonna... I'm not doing it, but it's called uh, the Fred's last song. It. The last song. I don't even know that. It's song. not a popular song. Yeah. It had what album vid- is that on? I have no idea. It's newer, right? No, it's, it, yeah, within the last. It was right around the time my brother you died. So it's got to be ninety. I got it on my one ninety two, ninety three, something like that. Is that why you cry? Because you think of your brother? Well, the, because the, I think I told you the video. The whole video is. Uh, <laughs> what? what? He cry- He's gonna cry. Well, wait, wait, let me work. Oh. What? What is the whole video? Wow, you can't even talk about the. Vi- wow, you can't. Even what talk is about the, the video? video? Oh, he's really crying. Oh my god. What is the video? I don't want to talk about it. Oh my god! Oh, my god. oh wow. yeah. Gary, you got one of those things, Gary. You can always Damn. cry on cue. <laughs> <You're just laughs> Holy crap! Oh my god! What, what is the video? Wow. Oh. oh. <laughs> I can't even I didn't, look at him. I didn't think this would set you off. What was I didn't either. We didn't wow. even play the song. No, really. Yet. What was the video? Can't even find it. Um, if you, if you would. <laughs> what? What was the video? Wow. I got. I got to compose myself. Seriously. Okay. It's just you know what? It's that. T- this is like when I get close to the holidays and stuff. It's a whole. Oh. The whole deal. You know. Uh, and nobody yeah. will even give him a tissue. You guys are so no, bad. Fuck that. <laughs> I didn't. I really didn't think this would happen. To be quite honest. Yeah, me neither. I didn't. I didn't think because I hadn't thought about it in such a long time. <laughs> we'll give him tissues. <laughs> Party did. He's fuck. What? Um, uh, what is the video? You know what? You I, it, it really. It's 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 hard for me to talk about, but it's about a guy who's dying of AIDS, and his father comes to visit him every night at the hospital, mm. and he doesn't think that his father. Would love him because he has AIDS, but inevitably his father. Oh, yeah, does. That's, that's rough. Oh, that's, that's rough. And my dad did. You know, my dad did go to visit him every night. Right. And I think that my brother, and my father, had that similar relationship. I think that my father is like old school Italian from Little Italy, mm. and when he found out my brother was gay, he accepted it. But I don't think he was crazy about it. And you know, when when it came, look time, at Sal wearing the I mask know, and dabbing his eyes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but, All right, thank you. That's good. But you know, that's but because yeah, Sal's never cried right, on the show. Right. But when my brother got really sick, and, and every time I hear the song, it makes me think of the video, and the video thinks, makes me think of like literally looking in a hospital room and seeing my father and my brother. Now right. that's rough. That is rough. That's a- I don't even know that song. I'm yeah. embarrassed to say. And could, you know what? I probably we don't cry. have it. Could you cry in a tiny dancer? No, I can't. Like if I heard the song, I probably wouldn't cry now because what I, what really makes me cry is the video. Yeah, thinking right, about the, the song right. makes me think of the video. So you got me, and you don't even need the song. Right. All right. Good. All right. Thank you Oof, for that. That was weird. Yeah. Yeah. You really lost. I'm it. sorry. That it's was right. fucking weird. You don't no. have to apologize. We like emotion. I'll just walk by all 32 members of Duran Duran. <laughs> <laughs> by the way, yeah, okay, because yeah, you at least said hungry like the wolf. Make-
don't know what happened. You know, I said that if I thought that that would happen, I, uh, I clearly wouldn't have went in. And I went in to talk about it and tell them what a bunch of douchebags they were for the last time they made me cry. And, uh, you know, I don't know. It's, just, it's, it's a long story and, you know, it's very involved. It's obviously very emotional to me because if it wasn't, I wouldn't cry. Um, and it's upsetting to me, but it's, it, it weirds me out that that can happen so quickly without...